photographs of a woman handing out money to people are making rounds on social media. She wore a red T-shirt with the word Harapan on it. MIC on Sunday called on its members to report the incident to the Election Commission, Malaysian Anti-Corruption Commission and the police so that actions will be taken against M. Managaran, Pakatan Harapan's candidate for the Cameron Highlands by-election. My police, SPR, dan juga SPRM untuk membatalkan pencanolan, pencalonan wakil lagi di sini itu Manohara. Tindakan ini mesti diambil oleh mereka. Sebab mereka ini mengatakan bahawa kerajaan ini adalah kerajaan Malaysia baru. So kalau Malaysia baru, dia kena ambil tindakan tegas. Kalau tak, ini bukan Malaysia baru. Semalam, ketiga-tiga calon telah sign petition oleh bersih. Iaitu diorang nak clean, fair and transparent election tanpa apa-apa uh, bribery. The MIC leader had earlier lodged a report at the Tanah Rata Police Station. Jelai Pakatan Harapan Operations Center Assistant Chief Arwin Barrett said the money was a reimbursement for patrol paid out to Pakatan Harapan volunteers during Saturday's nomination day. In a series of tweets, MACC Chief Asar Harun replied to remarks made by netizens, including disqualified Cameron Highlands MP Dato C. Sivaraj, who claimed that it's okay for Pakatan Harapan to be involved in money politics because they are in the government. But the opposition is punished for organizing events for its election machinery. Ashar said the difference is that in Sivaraj's case, the court made a finding of fact that is not appealed against. He added that those with direct evidence and not hearsay should lodge reports on the matter.